the Pilsner out of the fridge today. Haven't liked the Pilsner yet. What be going down, people of the world? Redbeard here, coming at you from his couch. Welcome back to another daily drink vlog for the beer of the today. We have got a can of Polywanta Pilsner by the Hop City Brewing Company. Yeah, possibly the uh, the best name for a beer that I've seen in a while. That's hilarious, and the label's great. The, the kind of funky, cartoony little Polly, whatever kind of bird he's supposed to be. I don't know, probably a cockatiel or something. I don't know what I'm talking about, really. Pilsner. Ah, let's crack her open. Fucking explode on me. For today's glass, we're good. Let's see what we have got. I don't, I don't have an actual Pilsner glass. So this, this is kind of close to a Pilsner glass. As always, all the thanks in the whole wide world for those who watch my videos. The Beard loves you all. So very, 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 very much. Yeah, he does. Sorry about the glare on the can. I need to do something about that. Like if I hold it like that, you can see it. But then it gets kind of... I don't know. I apologize. I I'll work on that. This looks... Looks nice. Lots of bubbles. Doesn't have a really overpowering smell of any kind. Let's give her a shot. Okay. Nothing amazing, but at the same time, nothing, nothing really bad about it either. I, I might be okay with this beer. Possibly the first Pilsner that I have ever been okay with. I don't know. Let's do this. Cheers, everybody. Yeah, I don't really know what to say. It's not... Not hoppy. I guess kind of more malty a little bit. It's got the, the Pilsner hops, I guess, are in there, so... Maybe it is kind of hoppy. I don't know, I'm not getting a hoppy presence. Myself. I don't tend to really know what I'm talking about, though, so... Take my opinion at your own risk. Or something. I don't know. Yeah, not great, not bad. Okay. It's always very scary when that glass is sitting there. I, th I think we're okay. That is hard to read. Okay, here we go. Crackers are out and Pilsners are in. But our pills isn't your ordinary pills. Ours takes the best of German and Czech styles and blends together a brew worthy of any talking bird. Floral and spicy, crisp and refreshing, Polly definitely wants this Pilsner. 5% alcohol. Doesn't have ingredients, just says contains malted barley and wheat. Floral and spicy, eh? Maybe I can release some of the smell or something. Uh, that actually did help. But. Not floral, really. Maybe a different kind of spiciness that I am not familiar with. And therefore, an. an am unable to detect 
Today being July 8th, on this date in 1879, the sailing ship USS Jeannette departed San Francisco carrying an ill-fated expedition to the North Pole. It's actually pretty crazy. They got caught in ice and drifted for two years with the ice before getting free and then sinking. And pretty much all of them died and yeah, pretty, pretty crazy story if you care to look it up. In 1889, the first issue of the Wall Street Journal was published. It's kind of a big deal for some people, I assume. I've never read it myself. And in 1994, Kim Jong-il began to assume supreme leadership of North Korea upon the death of his father, Kim Il-sung. Oh yeah, you guarantee there's some kind of stupid, ridiculous, forced attendance party for him today like yeah you probably have to go and bow in some big uh, North Korea little fucked up here's to you you crazy insane son of a bitch I don't know what to say about it. It's just, it's beer. Like, it's got flavor, but it's not... Not anything really jumping out at me. Like, the things blend together almost too well, I guess you'd say. Into this... Okayness. One other thing that actually happened on this date in the past, in 2011, the Space Shuttle Atlantis was launched in the final mission of the U.S. Space Shuttle program. And ever since then, the U.S. has been, like, hitching rides with the Russians, and there's, like, a spa another kind of space race happening right now for whoever can basically build the best replacement for it for them to use kind of thing. And Yeah, the Tesla, SpaceX, Elon Musk, that's his name. Doing some pretty cool shit. If you haven't looked into it, look into it. While I say, drink numbers are last! <sighs> Still okay. So, Hop City Brewing Company. Polly Wanta Pilsner. Rating. Five. That was as, I don't know, medium as you could get, I guess. I don't know what I'm talking about. It was okay. Then that's that's what the end of okay is, I guess. After that, it starts to become like we'd say, okay, five is okay. And we'll say six is good. Seven is very good. Eight would be great. 9 would be really great, and 10 would be, holy shit, that was a fantastic goddamn beer. There. Clarification. At some point, I'll make up something for the lower half, below 5. Yeah, that'll be fun. So maybe the next video? I don't know. And that's going to do it for today's Daily Drink Vlog. Thank you so much for watching this video. If you liked it, be sure to smash that like button with your face. Come on, come on, come on. Thanks again, and I'll be back with another Daily Drink Vlog. vlog, 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 vlog. I'll be back tomorrow. Another day, daily drink vlog. I can't see the other drink vlog. I, would, I can't talk. That's yeah. Things are happening. I don't know. Thanks again, and yeah, peace out. The inside of my home is a couple degrees warmer than the surface of the sun right now. I mean, cooler? Can't be warmer. It couldn't even be that temperature. I don't know what the hell. It's hot. It's so hot. It's too hot!